Our hometown Fridays are a big kickoff to a day of high school football. The games are something fans look forward to each week, of course, especially if your team is favored to win. All new this morning, we verify one question about what's supposed to kick in if the matchup gets a little lopsided. On Friday nights in fall, stadiums come alive across Arkansas as communities gather in the stands to cheer on their hometown teams. On the field, players battle for yards and points, but sometimes the competition can get a little lopsided. One verified viewer wants to know, are there official guidelines when the mercy rule is used in a blowout game? So let's verify. Our sources are the Arkansas Activity Association and the National Federation of State High School Associations. The Mercy Rule, also called the Sportsmanship Rule, is used during junior high and high school games in Arkansas if one team is clearly outplaying the other. Official guidelines say it should be put into place when one team has a lead of 35 points or more by halftime or at any point in the second half. Bobby Swafford with the Arkansas Activity Association says it is a recognized part of football and other team sports, first adopted by the National Federation of State High School Associations and later voted into the AAA's handbook. But sometimes things don't go your way. Maybe you didn't have the proper game plan. Maybe the team's better than you are, but we don't want to sit there and dwell on it. Once the mercy rule begins, the clock runs continuously to end the game sooner, only stopping for touchdowns and timeouts. A former Arkansas athlete himself, Swafford says he believes the 35 point number is fair and that the average of five possessions it would take the losing team to come back is unlikely, even in the best of turnarounds. He points out that while second or third string players might not have time to play, it's better to keep all players from potentially getting hurt. It also reduces lack of injury uh, because you think about it, you've got a team who is significantly better and a lot of, oftentimes if you're going to get a mercy rule, that's going to be the case. That means their players may be bigger, faster, stronger. That's going to limit the, uh, the amount of injury, the potential for injury against those teams who may not be up, up to that level as of yet. They're going to get there, but they're not there yet. So we can verify that, yes, there are official guidelines for the mercy rule and schools in Arkansas affiliated with the AAA must abide by them. According to Swafford, those schools make up roughly 99% of districts at the junior high and high school level. For teams that come from out of state to play in Arkansas, the rules for the game are determined by the local school host. So the mercy rule is one of them.